is it me, or has the Vampire Diaries been extra exciting lately? I can't believe the Salvatore brothers made it out of Klaus's mansion alive. P.S. Remind me never to go to a vampire dinner party. Well, they're back this week with an even more nail-biting new episode. So TVD is this week's number two. It would be rude not to dance, you know. This episode is a big episode because the original family comes back. It's about us coming together as the original family and our mother throws a big ball for everyone in Mystic Hall. We all got to get dressed up in our Cinderella gowns. All of the characters are thrown into the same room at the same time and this is a lot of volatile, powerful creatures. So everyone is killer dangerous and looking fantastic. Love is a vampire's greatest weakness and we are not weak. There's also another element which I've been pushing for for so long, which is a love interest. Certainly elements of my character that we haven't seen before are coming out. <laughs> I can you imagine Klaus saying I love you to anyone? Crazy. This cast is super close, but can they identify each other by just one tweet? I leave my chair alone for one scene and a squatter comes along. That was Ian. The guy spent like $1,000 or something on this chair. You've never seen a set chair like this in your life. And so whenever he's not on set, I feel it. <laughs> I sit on this chair all the time. He has a comfy chair. Let me tell you, these chairs seem pale in comparison. So every chance I get, I'm jumping on the IS chair. It's like, every time I see it in the morning, it's like, oh. But then there's usually someone sitting there, other than me. I don't even know why I got it for myself. 